What's going on YouTube? In front of you, you have a look at my homepage, but if you've ever been to the site before, you'll notice in the top right corner, there's a little toolbar there that isn't normally there when you go there to the site. What this toolbar is, is a function of the service that I use to host and maintain my site. And this service is called flavors.me. It is available in free and paid versions. Uh, I use the paid version, which allows me to have a custom domain name, as well as some additional layouts. But this is a free service, which anybody can sign up for, and anybody can create a, a homepage with, and start using it. So I'm going to show you some of the cool things you can do with the service that are built in. It takes a lot of the guesswork out of web design. Um, I've built websites before from scratch, and I just didn't want to deal with that for mine, just because this service does everything I needed to do and if you're a kind of person that doesn't want to look at HTML or CSS or PHP, Java, whatever you just want a home page that's nice, looks good and does what you need it to this is a great service so as you'll see at the top are the different uh, icons which go to my different services and the way you can add stuff into here is by clicking on design and you'll see it's on the manage uh, button I'm gonna go back and if you go to add you'll see there's lots of services listed here which you can add into this so say for example you sell stuff on Goodsy or you wanna put your Netflix account on here or you have a uh, Picasa account you wanna put in here uh, a while back I had Picasa on here but then I switched over to Flickr um, you can do that with all all these services you can add them in here and you can even add RSS feeds on here so say for example you want to have tabs up here for your favorite websites you like getting news from but you don't want to have to go to each site you could in theory have each tab up here be an RSS feed for your different favorite sites so for example I'm gonna go ahead and add one let's do an RSS feed so here I'm going to add an RSS feed which I've already copied into my clipboard. I'm just going to paste it in there. Hit connect. You see it's adding the feed. And now you see there's been there's a button that's been added to the top of my page and it's loaded all the RSS feed for that page. So pretty cool. Um, like I said, if you have a lot of sites you like going to but don't want to have to bother with actually visiting each and every site you could just put um, RSS feeds at the top and then if you want to you can even rename them so right here I'll just click on this little pencil icon hit enter and there you go let me hide this real quick you can see it's changed it other things you can do on the design portion let me go back here Layouts, you can pick different layouts. Uh, currently the one I have is the widescreen layout, uh, but there is a lot of other layouts you can pick. Some of these are paid um, layouts only, so if you don't want to pay and you're just using the free service, uh, you won't see all of these, but there's still a pretty good amount of layouts to choose from. And then in the options, uh, you can, like at the top, uh, if I don't want to show the icons, I can just have it show the titles and then you can of course change how the icons look as well as their size so a lot of neat features with this uh, service again flavors.me uh, I could probably spend a pretty good uh, amount of time going through every single one of these and giving you an in-depth tutorial but they already have some pretty good tutorials on their own site I just wanna make you aware that this site is out there so I will put links in the description to not only my homepage, but the Flavors homepage. And hopefully this helps those of you out there who like uh, creating your own website, get the job done faster, easier, and you have a good time doing it. There's also lots of other good sites that are hosted on Flavors, which are pretty cool to follow. Everything from photography to cooking and of course sites like mine which are technology and app reviews and stuff like that so if you like this video please give it a thumbs up 
make sure you hit that subscribe button and uh, check out flavors.me again free and paid versions of it available until next time take care guys and enjoy making a homepage for yourselves